What's happening out there everybody? It's Roll Easy here and I'm back with another Money Glitch video. Guys, I know it's Sunday night, but we do have a money glitch for you guys to take advantage of. And let me tell you, at first I thought this was a fake glitch. It is not, man. It is 100% legit. I couldn't believe it. I still don't really know how it works, to be honest with you, but it does work. I mean, it kind of makes sense that you're doing one thing while doing another in the game, so you're kind of confusing it but you do have to have a certain amount of money in your bank okay so you can get a free car with this and this free car you do need the amount of money uh in your in cash so in hand to buy it so we're gonna be buying the vigilante in this uh video tutorial so i need three million seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars to actually uh you know to buy it so i'm showing you guys how i'm setting up my account i went on a backup account that i do have because i have way too much money to move around on my main account so i went on this backup account and I'm actually going to go ahead and keep, you know, depositing or sorry, withdrawing, you know, money to put in cash. And I need three million seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars in cash in cash on me. And I need one hundred dollars in the bank. OK, that's how you have to do it. Now, the bank money, the one hundred dollars that needs to be exact. The cash it can be, you know, around one thousand dollars over. All right. Not under because you need the amount of money to buy, you know, the vehicle. So I'm showing you guys how I'm setting this up right here. So what I'm doing right now is I'm actually going ahead and I'm withdrawing money, you know, from my, this, see, this is the car right here. We're trying to buy $3,750,000 for the vigilante right there to the left. Uh, what I'm doing right now is I'm withdrawing money from my bank. Since I have a lot of money in my bank, I'm withdrawing money to put in cash, you know, so that I have it in cash. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to withdraw more and more money as you can see right here now the atms and the money in your you know in the internet you know bank you can withdraw and deposit different amounts of money so i'd say try both you can withdraw and deposit different increments so what i'm going to do here is i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to go into my internet right here and this is where i'm going to withdraw the rest of the money because you can actually withdraw i think over a million dollars at a time uh in the internet web browser so right here i'm going to go ahead and go to withdraw you know it's kind of confusing at first you got to play with all the numbers but yeah you see i'm going to withdraw another million dollars and you see this is going to give me three million eight hundred thousand dollars so i'm a little bit over right there you don't want to be over that that much so i'm going to go ahead and go back in and i'm going to deposit some of that money back into my uh my account so i'm basically depositing a hundred thousand dollars at a time so that i can get to the exact amount of money that i need to be at to buy the vigilante so, okay, I'm going to deposit a little bit more now. Uh, I got to deposit at least till I get up to $3,750,000. Okay, that is the price. So, here we go. All right, I'm, key, I'm still doing it. It takes me a little bit, guys, because it is weird at first, you know, not, not knowing exactly, you know, what to do with this. So, here we go. I'm, I'm still going. I'm still going. And I'm about to, you know, I'm about to deposit another $10,000. And there we go. $3,750,000. But I would recommend putting another hundred. So you see in the top right, I have three million seven hundred and fifty thousand and one hundred dollars. All right, that's the amount of money you want on cash in cash on you. Okay, on your main account. So once you have that much on your main account, go ahead and we're gonna swap characters. Now you want to swap characters because now you need to get rid of all the money in your bank. The two characters share the same bank account, so you can screw with the cash and you can take out all the uh, all the money in the bank. So as you can see, $3,750,100. Okay, so the $3,750,000 for the vehicle I want, the $100 we're gonna need after to put into the bank. Okay, that's what I recommend. So go ahead and swap characters, go to your second character, and now that I'm on my second character, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm actually gonna withdraw all the money that I have in the bank. You see, that's the same exact amount of money I had on the other character in the bank, all right? The bank is the bottom, cash is on top, all right? Cash is the dark green, uh, you know, and the bank is the light green. So as you can see right here, I'm gonna go ahead and withdraw all the money from the bank so that it's on cash and on the second character, all right? You wanna get rid of all the cash. So I'm doing it $1 million at a time through the phone. Uh, I found this to be the most efficient for me since I only had, you know, about $3,600,000. So, a little bit of math involved, but it's all good. You know, it's all good. Just get it set up, you know, like you see me doing right here. So, I'm on the second character. I'm getting rid of all the money I have in my bank, and I'm putting it in hand, so in cash. So, I'm just fast-forwarding through all this stuff. I just keep withdrawing money and keep withdrawing money until I have the majority of it all in uh, in cash on the second character. You don't want it in the bank. In the bank, between both characters, you only want 100 bucks. As you can see right there, I literally only have $10 now in the bank. 
that's okay. We can work with that. All right. So if you're left with like, you know, 50 bucks or something like that in the bank or, you know, $45, anything less than that, you're good. So now that I have just $10 in my bank, I'm going to go ahead and hit swap character again. And we're going to go back to our main character that we're going to be buying the, uh, the vehicle on, you know? So now that we're back here, as you can see, $3,750,100 in cash. And I have the $10 in my bank account. So account balance, 10 bucks. I'm going to go ahead and I'm actually going to, at first I wanted to start depositing, but I realized I can just withdraw that $10 so that I can have the exact amount I need. So you see, withdraw 10 bucks. I'm going to withdraw $10 and then I'm going to have $0 in my bank. All right. So there we go. $0 in the bank and I have $110 over in my cash. Okay. So now what I need to do is go ahead and deposit a hundred bucks. All right. Into the bank account. So I'm going to deposit $100. This number needs to be exact in your bank account. You want to have exactly $100 in your bank account. So you see, I'm de I deposited 50 bucks. Now I'm going to go ahead and deposit another 50. Boom. I'm set up to do the glitch. I have a hundred dollars in my bank account. I have $3,750,000 and ten dollars in my uh cash okay remember the cash you can be around a thousand over max all right you don't want to be too much over uh but the bank you want exactly a hundred dollars all right so we're set up to do the glitch now and this is really easy guys so check it out integrity way i have nine vehicles in there you can do this in a garage with a bunch of vehicles you know you can override a vehicle with this i recommend having a garage with an empty spot to do this so you see i have nine vehicles no vigilantes right there that's integrity way so nine vehicles and integrity way all right that is the garage i'm going to be ordering the vigilante and you see that integrity way that's what i just clicked on i have nine vehicles in integrity way that's the one with the oppressor and the retro all right so now i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to go to this open area bmx is over here helping me out you know as always shout out to you bmx and now we're ready to do the glitch so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to purchase the Vigilante. Now I'm going to, I'm not going to confirm it right here and pick which garage I want to go to. At this moment, you want to tell your friend, go ahead and call a mugger on you. All right. So at this moment, I'm telling BMX, I'm set up to go. I've purchased it, but I haven't picked a garage for it to go to. You guys know, normally when you pick a garage for the vehicle to go to, that's when the money gets subtracted out of your account. So we're going to glitch the game into actually, uh, you know, buying the vehicle, but it's not actually gonna, you know, take the money out because the mugger is gonna be coming after us. So I'd recommend getting in a place like this, open parking lot, make sure you don't have an oppressor buy because check it out, don't have any sort of vehicle buy because the mugger will use it. All right, so check this out. He's gonna hit me, A, confirm, just like that, okay? So as you can see, sorry if I startled you guys, but I confirmed it right there. Now you wanna go ahead and kill the mugger. All right, we, were, we weren't, we were in free aim and I didn't realize, I thought we were in assist today. I'm trying to find him right here. There we go, there's the mugger, went ahead and killed him. Now once you kill him, go ahead and run over and grab your money. And now check out my money. I still have the exact amount that I had when I started off the glitch. $3,750,000 and then $100 in the bank, okay? I still have all my money, the, the, it was not subtracted out and I purchased the vigilante. So I'm just fast forwarding now until I actually get over to the, uh, you know, to the point where it was delivered. So I'm going to get the message real soon here. All right, check it out. Vigilante was delivered to Integrity Way, you know, apartment 30. And look at that. My money is all still there. That's exactly how you want to do this glitch, guys. Okay, and I hit this glitch consistently after this. I did it another two or three times, and I got more and more vigilantes, all right? So you can do this with any car. You just want to make sure you have the amount of money for that car in cash on hand on you. So check it out. Integrity Way 30, that was the one. And look at that. I have a vigilante right there. Now I'm going to go ahead and call it up just to prove to you guys that I really do have it. All right, this glitch is 100% legit, not fake whatsoever, although it looks totally like a, a glitch that I wouldn't even think would be real, but it freaking works, man. I don't get it. <laughs> it's crazy. I have no idea who the founder is. I'll link them once I find out, but check it out. There's the vigilante right there, and now I'm going to go ahead and hop in it, and I'm going to tell BMX to hop in it, and yeah, it's real, man, 100%. I just got this car for free. It's frozen money. Yeah, you literally have a frozen bank account when you do this. It might not be the regular frozen money that we're used to, but the, the hardest part about this glitch, to be honest, is getting your money set up. But once you've got your money set up, you know, you're ready to go and you can do this back to back to back. I will warn you, though, you know, don't get cops on you. Don't get killed. Uh, don't blow stuff up. Don't screw around with this. Just once you have your money set, just keep doing this glitch back to back to back to keep getting all the cars that you need. You just need the amount of money for the vehicle. As, as for example, the Vigilante costs $3,750,000. You want within $1,000 of that. 
inside or in cash and then exactly this must be exact a hundred dollars in the bank okay so go back in the video to see how i moved money from character to character and then you can do the same all right but that's gonna be it for me my name is roll easy hope you guys liked the video and enjoyed it and if you did make sure to slap that blue thumbs up if you liked the video comment down below subscribe if you're new by hitting that big red button and turn on them post notifications for the freshest and most informative dope gta 5 online content peace out everybody